<clears throat> Hello and welcome back to Bill and Dan's Excellent Emporium. Now that we have our eBay account, I think maybe we should go shopping for something and figure out how you actually buy an item on eBay. So at the top of every eBay page, there is a search bar. You can buy literally anything on eBay. Almost anything. You're not allowed to sell guns, alcohol, or cigarettes. But otherwise, you can buy just about anything on eBay. Um, I happen to be looking for an old Spirograph suspension art kit. So I'm going to type that into the listing or into the box up here at the top of the page. I'm just going to type a few keywords. You don't have to type the whole name. You'll get more results if you only type a few words and then click search. Oh, look. There are actually two Spirograph suspension art sets here. Um, I'm going to look at this one at the top because it's a little bit cheaper um, and the picture's a lot better. So, uh, one of the neat things about eBay is that today they have ways of supersizing the photos. It didn't used to be like this. It used to be much harder to see what you were buying. But now eBay allows the sellers to list up to 12 uh, photos for free. So most, many do list a number of photos. And you can use this little arrow to uh, move across the 12 photos that have been listed. So this looks like a pretty cool toy. I think that my niece, would, my niece would love this toy. It still has the instructions. Um, it looks like it's in great condition. Let's go um, back, back and read the description. The description, you have to scroll down the page and a good seller will have a good description. It was, it's uh, gently used uh, produced by Kenner in 89. It's 100% complete. The pens still work. Explains how the apparatus actually works. The box shows a little wear. But all in all, it sounds like a great, uh, exactly what I'm looking for. So I'm just going to click this big blue button that says buy it now. Now you can also, if you're shopping for more than one thing on eBay, just add it to your cart and after you have found all the things that you want to buy today, you uh, go to the shopping cart and check out, just like at any other um, e-commerce site. So I'm going to click Buy It Now. And it's immediately going to take me to uh, where I need to give them my address because we've never put our, we didn't give them our address when we signed up with our account. So this is my address. I live in the great state of North Carolina. They remember that uh, my phone number, they already knew it, so I click continue. Oops. Apparently there's something wrong with my zip code, which doesn't make sense, but I'll just take out that extra four. Now we're here. You can pay directly with a credit card now. You have to enter your uh, credit card details or um, you, you can pay with PayPal, which means you probably need a PayPal account. But look at how quickly it just um, gets you set to pay with PayPal by popping up with the PayPal screen, and that's my PayPal account, so it's already ready for me to log in. But I'm not actually going to purchase this item, I'm just showing you how to do it. You can change the shipping address if you need to. If you go down further, this seller has three options for shipping. You can choose the one that is the most reasonable price, that's the price that you'd like to pay. So USPS Priority Mail is 830, which is, prob it, which is probably the fastest of these three. Um, 
parcel select is 678 for just a little bit more you can get this item much faster so i'm going to pay for usps prior to mail so there you have it um that was a very simple search on ebay Continue, uh, please stay tuned for our next video on setting up a PayPal account. Thank you. Bye for now.